We've been in this location for about 15 years, in business for a little over 30. I've, I've heard a lot of different things about the light rail. I do know they're starting on 280, and basically this is a starting point working east. Well, University Avenue will be reduced to one lane each way at times throughout the construction. But of course, there's lots of businesses on the corridor. People need to get to work. Customers need to get into shops. Delivery drivers need to make their deliveries. We're a tough one to put into words. You name it, we've sold it in 50 years. Name's Eric Likes, uh, manager of Axeman Surplus Store. We're just a block west of Snelling on University. Been here for going on about 50 years now. My main hope is we survive the construction of it, that our customers can get to us. You know, the street's torn up right now, and it's affecting business today, for sure. So the job of the project office is to make sure that all these people can get where they're going while the University Avenue is under construction. It's a bit like having to live in your house while it's being remodeled. I feel that I'm lucky in the fact that we have off-street parking next to our building, which is our basically a, a part of our property, and I'm aware that there's going to be an inconvenience for people to get here, but I think the inconvenience is going to be, uh, there's a time constraint, but it's going to be short-lived once you get used to it. You know, it's, it's all about increasing transit options for this corridor. So I'm hoping in the long run, the inconvenience in the beginning will justify itself in the end, yes.